right so it's dark right now because it is the evening and I just got, I have got busy throughout the rest of the day but this is what it looks like and I really really like it I think it's really important when you uh, use clip-in extensions that you don't just clip them in and that's it you should customize them according to your hairstyle that you have or that you want so that's really important that we do that so i'll give you guys a little bit of a uh, back history i have been working with two all my black girls for a couple of years now i've had i have a playlist right here on this channel of all of the videos that i have done working with this black owned uh, hair company and their brand is on clip-in extensions specifically for natural hair beauties like me so and like you guys if you're watching this so I had other textures uh, from this company as well um, I've had the I believe this is like the, the curly this is the kinky straight and what I have in my head now is the kinky course. So I believe there's quite a, quite a few other um, like textures that she probably has online. So you can check that out. I'll make sure I put it down in the description box. All right. But, so this is what it looks like the next day. And I actually ended up adding one more like single clip. I added uh, one of these single clips into this side just so it'll look a little, I don't know, cuter on this side. But yeah, this is the Kinky Course and I have two, uh, two clip wefts in here and one um, small one, single clip. So what makes them different than other companies when they uh, do... Uh, clip-in extensions is that they have this um, bias tape that's on here before they put the um, the clips on so I think that's really cool that they do that but obviously you can sleep in them my suggestion is to like just release the clips so when I say release the clips meaning they're closed and then you just want to pop them open and you can leave them in so um, my suggestion if you are a person that's going to wear short hair more often, like I do, um, you only need one pack because it's enough hair for you to have maybe multiple styles or maybe multiple lengths because you will have to customize it or cut it a certain way so that it fits your ideal hairstyle or as close to your current hairstyle as possible just to give you a little bit more volume and things like that. So you definitely want one. But if you want to do a full head, whether you have short hair or a lot of hair, I would suggest you get two packets because that's I mean, it's just a better option. You have be, you'll have enough of the length to actually cover your entire head and not have to worry about any leave out for that sense. But um, yeah, so you will be seeing more videos of me uh, with this. Uh, I'm going to show you what I'm going to be doing with this one. I, I have I have a playlist. I mentioned that in the previous clip. But I do have a playlist of me using uh, the curly one and some parts of this. But I'm going to dye this a little bit darker. So, uh, and then kind of work with it and see what I can do with this long length. So, um, other suggestions, be careful. The length that you get, um, 14 inches, what I've gotten uh which appears long but you have to cut it so i think that's the shortest length that they have so if you want a shorter length uh ask and see but i believe that's the shortest length that they have but just know that you're just gonna have to customize you're gonna have to cut i had to cut so um if you want short hair but this is the best uh hair extensions i've worked with so yeah so check down below in the description box for all the informations and links to go and purchase and i will see you guys in the next video either with this in another style or something else see you in the next video